The University at Albany is very proud and lucky to have one of the largest concentrations of atmospheric scientists in the country and the largest in New York State. We have the Atmospheric Science Research Center. We also have the Department of Atmospheric and Environmental Sciences. We also own and run, uh, having built, the New York State Mesonet. It's a, it's a world-changing network of weather observations across the state. There is nothing else like it in the country or anywhere in the world. We have the Excite Lab, which is state-of-the-art computing resources, as well as visualization. And we have just great faculty, great staff, and great students. It's interesting working in New York State because uh, we have a lot of severe weather, be it in the winter or the summer. And what's relevant to, to NYSTAR is the fact that uh, businesses, most businesses, are sensitive to weather uh, as well as climate. I'll give you an example. Utility companies have to make decisions on whether to deploy crews in, in, in ahead, ahead of extreme weather or after extreme weather. Utility companies are the easiest companies to work with because they know very well that they, they are sensitive to weather. That could be just due to severe weather in the winter, icing on the lines, bringing trees down. So all the sectors are impacted, be it utilities, renewables, transport, commerce, agriculture, they're all affected by weather. So our job is to do the research, to find the pain of these companies and what they're doing about the weather now and how they can deal with it in the future. By dealing with it and mitigating it, you can save money, save jobs, make money. I enjoy educating companies about the weather sensitivity they have and I enjoy exploiting the tools that we have here. These are resources that can be used by business across the state. So, and we also have a culture here where faculty, staff and students want to do applied research for the benefit of these companies and the economic development of the state. And I think that's a huge advantage that the businesses have, not only in the capital region, but across the state.